Hey guys, Dominic Zone here. Do you want heart pounding action, tear inducing drama, and passionate romance? Then what the hell are you doing here? We're gonna play Derpy and the Hunting of the Super Tasty Muffin. Yay! From what I understand, Derpy and the Hunting of the Super Tasty Muffin is a text RPG. A text RPG. Text. Okay. Think Zork. You know that Easter egg from the terminal in Call of Duty Black Ops? Yeah, like that. Those are actual games that exist. <laughs> now, 90% of my viewers understand. So, uh, let's do it. It's right here. We're going old school. I really like the, the way they did this. It looks quite authentic. Uh, if you're wondering, have I played this before? The question, the answer, as always, is no. I have looked up the tutorial though, because I don't want to be a complete clueless fucktard. So, uh, let's play this for the first time ever. Uh, I guess the highlighted words are commands that I can use. It's a nice sunny day in Ponyville. A lot of ponies haste over to the marketplace. Oh, they're supposed. I think you're missing a co comma there. A lot of ponies haste over to the marketplace, others doing their daily tasks like selling goods at their stalls, dressing the windows of their shops and talking to other ponies. The spicy smell of the hot, fresh apple pie tickles your nostrils. You're looking at the fountain watching the water drops. Lyra Heartstrings beckons to you. Okay. So, to write a command, we write a verb and a noun or a subject or whatever. For example, let's try this. Can I touch water drops? Feels soft. What? Water is soft, I guess, in a weird way. All right. Okay, that was a test. Now let's let's get into the story. Talk to Lyra. Hey, Derpy. Good to see you. Would you like to do me a favor? Is it watching your shoes? I don't know. What is it? No. I've got better things to do. No, Derpy is. I think. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Is it washing your horseshoes? Um. No. I just want you to. Oh, is it jumping off the town hill? Town hall? No. Is it putting my nose into a giant pot of honey? Not what I thought. Brushing your tail? Um, no. Painting muffins on all houses? Derpy, stop it! I only want you to bring back this book to Twilight Sparkle. Oh, I guess I can do that. Great! I think she's at the Golden Oak Library. Here, take the book and bring it back to her. I have to move now. I have to move on. Bye and thanks. You can count on me. Maybe. Then what does she have to do? I don't think the marketplace is that far away from the library. New item, book. Awesome. It's a nice sunny day in Ponyville, and uh, that's the exact same description. Okay. Let's get distracted. Woohoo! What happens if I type "go to Ponyville" since I'm already in Ponyville? You can't go to Ponyville. But uh, but I'm in Ponyville. Never mind. Can you write check out marketplace? What does check out marketplace mean? All right, in your language, look at marketplace. This is your town, your home. Quite a nice place to live and eat muffins. Okay. Eat muffin. There's no muffin to eat. Get muffin. There's no muffin to get. <sighs> find muffin. You're looking for muffin, but you can't find it. Wait. You're looking for muffin. Something is not right there. Alright, so does that mean that if I type find anything, it'll give me that sentence? Find cheap ass. Oh. You're looking for cheap asshole, but you can't find it. 
I knew it, I knew it. Alright, no, enough fucking around. Um, this turned non-PG very fast. Alright, go to library. There are a lot of books here. Everywhere are shelves filled with knowledge about the most things in Equestria. One of... one of the bookend... I have a feeling this was not made by an indigenous English person. One of the bookends holds a very big brown book with magical runes on its board. Stairs are going up to the second floor with even more books and a bed in front of a large window. Twilight Sparkle stands in front of a shelf and goes through the books very meticulous. Hmm. Go to second floor. Invade privacy. You don't have to go there. Do anyway. What does do anyway mean? Go to second floor. <laughs> Alright, yeah, um, chalk to twilight, I don't, I only have to type twilight, right? Yeah. Hello, Derby. Nice to see you here. Yeah, what is this place? I know what place it is. Lyra gave me that book, and I should give it to you. Had to go, bye! <laughs> oh, wonderful. Hope she learned a lot from it. Maybe you could put it back into the shelf, please? I really have to go on with that spell I'm working on. Don't ask Derpy to put a book in a shelf. I assure you it's going to end up with all the books not in the shelf. Alright. Yes, ma'am. Twilight wants you to put the book you got from Lyra into the right shelf. But which is the right one? There are three rows on this shelf. There's a shelf to your right and another one to your left. Twilight Sparkle is sunk in a book. Play, put book in left shelf. Go left. A bookshelf with more books in three rows again. There is a shelf to your right and another one to your left. Place book. Where do you want to place the book here? First row. What does first row mean? Row. What does row mean? Left. What? Where do you want to place book? Place book left. There's no book left you can place. Oh, there's no book left. There's no book left. It thinks book left is an object. So, for example, if I would type place dildo there's no dildo you can place exactly <laughs> go right then place book on a row place book where do you want to place book shelf what the shelf ah place book where do you want to place book Good lord. Uh. Place book Twilight Sparkle. What does Twilight Sparkle mean? Uh. Go right. Look at row. You can't see something like that. Uh. Place the fucking book. There's no f there is no the fucking book he can place. Uh, <laughs> what if I just type book? What does book mean? It means place the fucking book, that's what it means. Uh, what does up your ass mean? What does you understand when you go <laughs> Place book in shelf. You can't place book there. Alright, fuck this. Talk to Twilight. Please, Derpy, can you put back that book first? Put back book. There's no back book you can put. Ah! Ah! <laughs> 
Oh god. <sighs> Look at first row. There is the books in this first row are about pony history. Place book here. Look at second row. This row contains a book about unicorn magic, like spells and any kinds of shields. Place book. Second row. Look at third row. In this row, you can see books with titles like the official pony etiquette manual, or what a pony never should boo, but read book. Playing harp for dummies says the title, but after reading all this word, but re but after reading all this words in the table of contents, you're very confused. Look at second row. I'm just, I mean. If you're wondering what I'm trying to do right now, it's basically I want to see if I can find a row that is dedicated to music, you know, where this book would fit. Look at third row. Books about something. Alright, it belongs here. Place book. Among books about something. Say that again. Yes, I will. What's your problem? Fuck you. Yeah, yeah, I said it. I said it, bitch. Up yours. <laughs> what does up yours mean? <sighs> books, books, books. First row is very messy. Calendars. One of it takes the note. Find out what R34. Show Twilight R34. There's no Twilight R34 you can show. Oh, I'm sure you can find some. Take Quilt. Wait. How can she fit 147 episodes of The Daring Do in one row? Woohoo! I can take it! Alright, you know what? Fuck this. Hint. Read Shelf. Read Shelf. Read Shelf. Reading isn't your. <laughs> oh, now we're now we're getting offensive. <laughs> books. It's you. You put that as a command. All right. Read books. Sigh. Bookshelf. You can't put book there. Of course. Why would you be able to put a book in a bookshelf? Hint. Hit. What? Hi, Twilight? I don't think she likes bondage. She wanted to know what Rule 34 means. That's I'm just I'm just saying. I'm just saying I'm willing to help out here. Talk Twilight. Alright, fuck this, I'm gonna look up the guide, hang on. Alright, this motherfucker right here seems to know. You have to find the right row in the right shelf. Have a look at the book and every net and every row to get the clue. That's what I've been trying to do, but... Ah! Go to shelf. First row. Under a fine print, being abstinent until marriage, you find a large collection of Playpony magazines. Your eyes open wide as you see Fluttershy on the newest cover. You're watching her photo series very thoroughly. One quarter of Fluttershy is written in bold letters. But I'll never show my... Pinky. Look at second row. Books about music. Oh, thank God. You can see books about some famous conductors besides learning books for different instruments. There's also a record. Vinyl scratch party. Blah, 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 blah. Place book here. Place book. Where do you want to place book? That was the third row, right? Oh, God. Oh my god! Oh! 
You put the damn book into the damn shelf. And discover a piece of paper. Thank fucking god. You're holding a recipe for a super tasty muffin of awesomeness in your hooves. Your eyes begin to gleam and spit leaks out of your mouth corner as you see this fantastic piece of tastiness. Is this a word? The ingredients are very special due to that you're getting more and more curious. Due to that, you're getting more and more curious. You decide to bake this baby, whatever the cost.